just crossed over into the Twilight Zone. You are now traveling through another dimension. A dimension not only of sight and sound, but of fuckery so insane that the human mind can hardly comprehend it. Ayo, ayo, it's your boy CJ, and we back at it like a crack addict with a bad habit. And today, I, well, right now, I'm just tired in general. Today, I was tired, let's just put it that way. But right now, it's like nighttime for me, and I wasn't going to make this till tomorrow, but I said, screw it, I'm going to make it now. So if I look tired, stoned, it's probably both. <laughs> But yeah, I'm excited for these updates. I'm always excited and I should use a different word. So yeah, I need to use a different word for excited. Like I am exuberant for these updates. Straight goods. Yeah, I know Bam, like I said, he's one of my favorites. I've been watching him forever and I know lots of you guys have been too. He was just like the heart and core for Jackass. He really was. Him and Steve-O, I find the best and they have the biggest fan base to this date, I believe. Is there any more? Yeah, no, not really, huh? Yeah, it's really just Steve-O and uh, Bam that's been going, reaching higher and higher climates, which I respect that so much. Like, Steve-O's doing the best right now. He's sober, making content for his fans. He's doing so much, and I respect that so much. And it's not like I don't respect Bam for putting out his content for his fans. He's just going through stuff right now. If he wasn't going through stuff, I bet you he'd be putting out stuff right now, straight up. But let me just get to this straight before I forget about it. Yeah, he only gave me a certain amount of time for this cameo, and that's okay. I don't care that much. So if you see other cameos after that, they're not they're going to be old, okay? And I'll try my hardest to find the date so I can show you what date it was when they said that. Do you know what I'm trying to say? Who? Who? So, yeah. Yes, I'm being a vulture. I'm trying to collect that monetization. <laughs> monetization. You know what I'm saying? Well, are you retarded? But, yeah. Sooner or later, you're going to end up seeing Novak for an update as well. And maybe, uh... Chris Pontius. If he's still up and going on that website. Man, that website? That cameo is such a dope website. Honestly, like... I'm going through this website so much and people have donated. I remember buying all these cameos at one point. I spent probably a couple grand on them. Yeah. But now, what, since like four months ago or more, more, a little bit. Around four months ago, people have started to donate, which is honestly awesome. And they don't want to be named, but... Guys, thank you so much from the bottom of my heart. And anyway, just for you watching my video right now, thank you. For the people that have watched me and not skipped to BAM, y'all the real heroes here, straight up. But yes, enough of me. Let's get straight into what BAM's got to say. Okay, oh, you teasing me. Oh, you naughty, naughty. You teasing me. Okay, okay. And I might add some other stuff what he wants to... I might add in other updates that I've posted before. Who knows? Maybe I've, maybe I've milked this video to the titties and maybe I can get it past eight minutes. We got to see. Hey, at least I'm admitting it to you. Lots of people don't, lots of creators don't admit that. So, I'm the good one. I'm, I'm sick of people saying that too. It's corny. Okay. What am I, what else am I supposed to say? <laughs> Guys, I love y'all so much and I'm a dip out of here. Peace out. What up, CJ? It's Bam here in Los Angeles. Uh, I just spent the past three days doing a video with the Spray Allen dudes. Uh, it's a member from Sublime. And uh, got Danny Way here. We're going to Schmidt Sticks. Uh, Danny's doing some uh, new board shapes for his Plan B thing going on. Then I'm going to head down to SoCal, check into my Airbnb, and uh, do some shit with the Shaman. And... Uh, do a bit more skating so that's what we got going on here rock and roll what up clayton cards bam margera here in hollywood i'm with uh gay keanu reeves what's up and uh we are editing right now the uh spray allen aka sublime video that we just shot spur of the moment my real estate rich buddy jeb cardi said that he was uh demolishing a house and if we wanted to go in there and do anything we want except light it on fire we're more than welcome so 
We uh, all drove up from SoCal and invited everybody last minute, and it worked out pretty beautifully. So uh, other than that, um, Jackass, on the other hand, they made me sign a fucking bogus contract that um, basically put me on way more pills than when I went in on Adderall and alcohol, and I came out on 18 other things that led to weight gain, dizziness, sore muscles, I couldn't skate, erectile dysfunction, balding, uh, fatigue and suicidal tendencies. So if, uh, if suicidal tendencies was the final result to 18 different medications, it was pretty on the brink of happening. So what would be the point of a contract of $5 million if I'm not around? So, uh, there you have that <laughs> rock and roll. <laughs> What's up CJ. <clears throat> so since I moved to San Diego, I, uh, I've had so much shit on my plate that I kept double booking myself and I'm trying to do so much shit at once that I could slowly see myself getting burnt out. So I had to take a step back for a minute, but so much cool shit has been happening. I'm working on a thrasher part with Gregson, uh, Riley Hawk, Tony Hawk's son is doing some tracks with CKY, uh, heart supply is, uh, printing a whole bunch of shit. I've been working with Steve-O and, um, yeah, man, everything's good. Uh, in Pennsylvania, I had nothing on my plate. So now that the fact that everybody's asking me to do shit, I, um, I started saying yes to everything, which nearly backfired because I was doing a hundred things at once until my head was going to pop. So, uh, <laughs> um, yeah, so I bought myself a planner and, uh, I'm not going to double book myself again. So <laughs> a lot of cool shit's happening. Rock and roll. What up, CJ? So what was so fun about filming the CKY videos was us not knowing what the fuck we were doing. Joe Franz got a 16 millimeter Bolex camera and, um, you know, when you hear that film sound, you know, it's $20, $40, $60. So, um, you tend to land tricks a lot quicker and, uh, you get that adrenaline rush that just makes you, you know, barge jackass style stunts. And, um, that's how Ryan Dunn got the nickname random hero was from uh, just going for it. Like he would even have a broken cast on his wrist and he would still jump off of a 20 foot roof into a bush, re-breaking his other arm. And then we would do shit like, uh, you know, put shit on a dollar out in front of a grocery store and see what asshole picks it up. And, uh, you know, we were just kind of just driving around the town of Westchester looking for people to fuck with and, um, you know, things to jump off of. And I never got any inspiration for people like Three Stooges or anything. It was more like watching Danny Way in the questionable video when, uh, he, you know, you would just throw a pie in somebody's face driving by and then a clip to him skating. Um, so, yeah, I'd have to give it to Danny Way. Yeah, man. <laughs>